Hello guys welcome to celebrity news and lifestyle where we give you the right update and all of what you will like to know concerning our music stars and movie superstars, so if you're new here or if at all you're just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you don't miss in any of my uploads. After Italy fell through, Kanye West and Ty Dolla Dolla Ein's album event won't happen this weekend either. That's why organizing a multi-stage listening event always seems like a daunting task. Kanye West and Ty Dolla Dolla Ein will not be holding a multi-venue listening event for their new joint album on Friday and will not be releasing the album that evening, sources told Billboard. On October the 23rd, Ty Dolla Dolla Ryan revealed his plans on social media for what fans expect will be similar to Donda's three major listening events she will host in 2021. The post on Ty's deleted Instagram account contains little information, except for text showing the yen symbol Y with a dollar sign, and the words multi-venue listening event on November the 3rd. Although no album has been officially announced yet, it is due out on October 1st. 13 Billboard magazine reported that the two artists collaborated on a joint album that they purchased from distributors. Until November. 3 was never announced as a release date for the album, but there was speculation that the duo would release it after the listening event. This is not the first time the event for this album has been postponed. Last month, sources told Billboard that the album was scheduled to be released on October the 13th, but was postponed as Yee's team continued to work on the distribution deal. Billboard later reported that Yee's team was working in Italy to find a concert location, as well as a listening party. The RCF Arena in Reggio Emilia went so far as to build a theatre that many believed was intended for the show, but a week later, sources told Billboard Italia that it was very unlikely that the show would take place. Now Yee and Ty are adjusting their plans. Aside from Ty Dollar Dollar Ein announcing an event less than two weeks ago, with only two days to go, no venue has been announced, and no tickets have been sold. In addition, there are a number of other issues that could make it difficult to hold the event this weekend or ever. Holding an event at the stadium featuring E would require weeks of planning with local authorities, purchasing expensive insurance policies, and extensive communication with fans. Combined with the fast-paced schedule and other variables, the fact that many of the nation's top stadiums are used by professional and college football at this time of year complicates matters. It's football season outside. Even teams whose home team will be playing away from home this weekend, or other upcoming matches, probably won't want to host an event like this that could damage the field or cause disruption to activities, especially for a very short period. Yi and Ty Dolla Dolla Ein have shared almost no details about the event they are planning, but based on the little information that has been made public, booking and staffing costs for an event that involves the use of several large stadiums will easily exceed $5 million. Unless Kanye wants to take that level of risk himself, he needs a backer to sponsor and promote the event. Thanks for watching to the end and guys don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments, matters see you next time.